Hello YouTube, it's DBTA Show, with you 2 Let's Play, part 37. In the last part, we got down to this cable car area, and the cable car's gone missing. Oh dear. Oh dear. Is it Leon again? That little twat is bugging off with the cable car. Uh, we might have a boss fight here, it might be the, it might have the fact that Claude comes through the roof. I don't think so, I think Leon already took care of that. I didn't, have to t I didn't have to fight the uh, the alligator, crocodile, whatever it is. What's the difference between an alligator and a crocodile? Uh, I think I think an alligator has uh, bigger quills on, on its back or something like that. Oh, alligators just bigger in general. I'm not entirely sure. I don't live in the Shit. bayou, so I won't know. You're okay. Oh, good She's hugging my crotch. <laughs> Yeah, another time and place that would be erotic, but right now, sorry. Did your mom give you something called G virus? Either a vial or a test tube? G virus? I've never heard of anything like that before. Are you absolutely sure? If you give yeah. it to me, I'll hold on to it for safekeeping. But I really don't have anything. It's the truth. Why would I lie? You're lying! <laughs> your mother said different and. Really uh, I'm not going to tell you where it is, and Adam never do you, it ruins the story. <laughs> I'll tell you where you can stick it. <laughs> stick the G-Virus up your ass. yeah, that's not a very good idea, because you probably had to turn into a giant monster. Yeah, you know a giant monster. <laughs> the four-arsed monkey. <laughs> what? <laughs> South Park, the four-arsed monkey. Oh, nothing. Anyway, like the, uh, like the Morty, yes, it shows you whether the key... A little shiny. So it's a good idea to take your light with, light with you here so you can get some extra ammo. This key also opens the um, things that your magnum, your magnum um, upgrade in the um, Leon scenario, but... I'm not sure what it gives me here. I, I honestly don't know what it gives me. Mm. Well, you can get your spark shot soon, I and then your infantry will be full. Oh, Maybe sure. you should have left your grenade launch behind. Maybe. If I find anything I need, I'll just come back for it. I can pause it for five, five minutes. Well, I know there's some herbs down here. The spark shot is just down here. Adam, there's two of them. Grenade launcher. That one, don't worry. Oh, right in the chest. <laughs> <laughs> Double impact, too. <laughs> Straight through one and out. Not with me. Anyway, examine the corpse and we get. Da, 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 da. <laughs> oh, if you play, if you play Zelda. Da, na, na, na. My favorite weapon. High voltage gun to repel experimental animals. <laughs> it uses spark shot rounds. Has a range of ten feet. <laughs> right, Adam. I think you use that one for now. <laughs> Behold the power of my lightning rod. Ooh, that sounded nasty. Come back. Oh. In my ace head, in my ace head. Doesn't, that doesn't work like that, I'm afraid. Aww. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's a spark Ed, shot. Ed, shot doesn't really do much <laughs> when, you, when you're zapping them anyway. And I mm. forgot it does take two hits to kill most zombies. Yeah, I'm a nutter. If it. you hold down the air bunker, you charge it up. No. Oh. It's just a uh, zap. It's got some recoil on it, on it, ain't it? And it knocks you back as well. So, oh, the hell. Eighty-two percent. Not bad. You don't get any ammo for this, do you, Adam? Nope. So that's a, so once you've used it, you've used it, you two. That's it. Yeah. It's similar to the machine gun in that respect. But it's worth it just to right, which tackle for these things. Yeah, I suppose. Um, you've got a boss coming up next, Adam. I wouldn't suggest it for that, though. I should just grenade launcher for that. Yeah. It's 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 okay for repelling zombies and dogs and that, but... What about lickers? What do you think? Lickers? Possibly. Yeah, it does stun them for a while. Silence. Sherry, 
wait here. I'm going to check it out by myself. Okay. I'll bravely I'm abandon you. Hurry back. I. <laughs> I'm not. Gonna... Alright, so we're just gonna pause the area we used to where I saw our inventory. Back in a few seconds. Right, you two, we're back. We just did a little bit of backtracking and we picked up a few herbs, looted this room, and that was pretty much it. In this room, there were some flame rounds, some acid rounds. So, on this, on this desk here. And uh, a health spray. In and also an ink ribbon. Um, now, we're going to open this door. Uh, to your left, Adam, on the barrels, there might be some handgun rounds. So, oh. since I've just got rid of my handgun because I've got my spark shot. Well, you can put me into storage for later. Handgun. Why are you taking the grenade rounds with you? Just in case. But you've got 29 acid rounds! 29! That's probably enough to decapitate Mr. X. Oddly enough, that's what I'm fighting. <laughs> anyway, that's uh... People have played Resident Evil Zero before. This is actually the same laboratory as in Resident Evil Zero. Is it the same laboratory? Yeah. Or is it just... Yeah, it's the exact same laboratory, but in Resident Evil Zero, you search different parts of it. Oh, fair enough. Camcorder. Security camera. Nice one. Hint. Ah. Take the control panel key. Thank you very much. Will you loot this cupboard? No, you won't because there's nothing worth looting. Oh. Turn on the monitor. Dun dun dun! <laughs> Spark shot him! That won't work sadly. Grenade launcher! Yeah, I've got to use a grenade launcher. Why can't you use a spark shot? Doesn't. It, very slow rate of fire, mate. Oh, no, of, co of course! <laughs> Powerful it may be, but it won't be enough to take down this geezer. I'm going to be able to run past him. He's, he's the size of the current. Aim higher! Ooh. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's down anyway, so it don't matter. <laughs> Four acid grenades that took him. He's pretty he's beefy, but he's punched you. He might. Ah, be foot. <laughs> I'll just mug him. <laughs> you, you use four, you get six back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, talk of. Okay, I may, I may have to use another green herd, but hey, sod it. Oh well, Mr. X didn't put much of a fight there. He punched us. Four acid rounds is down. He gave me six. So that's, that's a nice little profit. Yeah. For a rather cheap scare. I think you should drop the um, grenade rounds. Yeah, definitely. <sighs> Stop grunting. Can you get me a pillow? Uh, I mean a cushion. I, I can't. I. There you go. I'm not comfortable down here. I really aren't. It's tough. That's much better. <laughs> so yeah, this is where you use the control panel key you just got. That brings up the um, train. Well, from running. Thingy. Okay, Sherry, let's go. I've just finished Zelda Spirit Tracks YouTube. Really good Zelda game, much better than Phantom Hourglass, which is what I was hoping for. Um. So yeah. If you like Zelda, go for it. I might review it soon in my next um, set of reviews, but. Don't hold your breath. Yeah. <laughs> I might play the game through one more time so I know it a bit more. Anyway, you two, we've run out of time, so in the next part we shall delve into the bowels of the laboratory. Whooping. Cool 